everyone welcome back to chrono cross the radical dreamers edition for the pc so we gotta head to the el nido triangle another world we already went through the home world version of this area uh, much earlier on in the game all right there's a boat over here I discovered a mysterious object down below, but there's a nasty monster guarding it. No matter how many times I hack away at it, it doesn't seem to have any effects. I've tried, I've tried some elements too. There are some that work and some that don't. Yep, let's go on in. Been a while since we've been here, and we got some new enemies here as well. Puffy and Jelly Bubba. I don't know if we did fight these earlier or not, I'm not sure, but we might seriously surge. Quit missing. Oh I got kid in the party. I forgot to remove kid from last episode. Lovely. And I gotta leave and remove kid from the party. Alright, I'll go remove Kid and I'll be right back. Alright, I removed Kid from the party, put Glenn in there. Alright, let's continue to this area. I don't... I really don't see the pointy... Oh, my controller got it removed. There we go. Got to buy a new USB cord from my controller. But honestly, like I was saying though, there's not really much point in battling enemies in this area. Really. Uh, really there's not much point in battling at all at this point. Oh, we get a rainbow shell. So I'll pretty much just show off the new enemies, I guess, and that'll be it. Because there's just not much point. We're not gaining any stats, and the items that we get from the drops aren't worth it either. I'll show this battle off though, since it's a new enemy. Well, I think we did fight these before in another area, but yeah, Manta Ray. We fought, yeah, we fought these before, Sidestepper. But I'll show them again in this area. Nice if Surge would stop missing 80%. That <laughs> one damage. If that's all the damage you can do. Then Glenn will not fall. Pretty much no one's gonna get that reference. Ah, got frozen. I guess, it, is that a counter attack? Huh, I guess it is, it might be a counter attack. And this is another reason why there's no point in battling because they're doing one damage to me. <laughs> Zero damage, three damage. We have the ultimate equipment equipped is why we have the rainbow shell stuff. But I still need to have rainbow, um, uh, rainbow helmets, I believe. The accessory, whatever it's called. But I have enough rainbow shells to get those now, so. I'll be able to get those later on. So there's that thing that's guarding the uh, that dude was talking about earlier. Is there anything over here though? Yeah, there is. There's a chest. Another rainbow shell. All right. 
Not that I really need many more of them anyway, but it's there, I guess. All right, so got a pulse battle coming up ahead here. Um, if you have any fire in it, uh, element people, equip a. Let's see here. Where's it at? Let's see. Well, I'm trying to find the thing. Well, anyway, well, let me see if I can find it. I'm surprised it ain't showing up here. Where are they at? I know I have them. What the heck? Are they maybe equipped on somebody else? Or am I blind? What the heck happened to my... Oh, they're... Okay, I'm dumb. They're right here. My bad. I'm stupid. I forgot they were pieces of armor. Uh, but you want to equip a blue plate. If, uh... W we should be okay. Since we don't have any fire in it. Element people, but... If you do, you want to equip a plate on them. On the person who has the fire element. If you're using someone with a fire element. Alright. Let's go up here. And it's boss time. Against. World Jelly. Alright. So let's uh. Do a good holy light here. We might have to use uh, Elements Weak too, I guess, like Fire maybe. Not really sure here. That was like no damage to us, but we obviously do no damage to it either. I'm not even sure if I'll be able to beat this thing. I might have to change my elements up. We can try extract, but I don't think it's going to do any damage to it, right? Oh, it is, oh it's fire. Cause, yeah, of course. Okay, so. Yeah, you got to do fire attacks on it. Okay. <laughs> extract, extract happens to be fire, so. <laughs> That's how you easily take it out. Alright, 3 HP for Surge, 1 to Resistance. 15 to HP for Glenn, 1 to Strength and Magic, which... Magic's kind of bad. And then nine HP for Fargo, one to magic and or one to resistance and one to magic resistance. And we get a resistance belt as well. And a new element slot too. Yeah, that was a boss battle. Even though the random battle theme plays, so kind of weird, but that's how it is sometimes in this game. It won't open. It's a Starkey ship. We have to bring Starkey here. Okay. 
So, I'll go get Starkey, and I'll be right back. I'm going to leave, and then we'll put him in the party. Alright, I'm back. I got Starkey in the party, as you can tell. Wow. Starkey's ship in this world is not broke, not broken. Starkey am happy. Could that be the reason why we have air down here? Affirmative. Starkey's ship generates a special force field. Starkey think in the other world, Starkey's ship is in pieces and the parts are buried underground but still working. Yeah, it opened. <laughs> yeah, everything is in order. The navigation system is operational. <laughs> Starkey's bed is nice and cozy. Cozy, too. There's two eyes there. Two O's. Can this take us to Terra Tower? The ship is only big enough to fly Starkey. Then what do we do? Leave it to me. What the? The engine may be a bit rusty, but otherwise perfect. Oh yeah, that. Hmm. Maybe we can use this. Starkey may be able to scrounge up more stuff. Starkey will come back later. BZ does it. What is this? It is an anti-gravity device. If you attach this to your boat, it will fly to Terra Tower easily. All we need now is a facility to install it. I remember there the dock inside of Chronopolis. Alright, let's be on our way to Chronopolis. <laughs> Trying to talk Starkey's language is kind of weird. Let's see. Starkey need this and that. Oh yeah. This should do the trick. All you have to do is load that thing on the boat, right? What are you talking about? We need to attach a stabilizer to keep the auto gyro from spinning out of control. I don't get it, but just hurry it up, okay? Yeah, please do, so I can stop talking like Starkey. Time to get to work. Phew. Starkey am done. What do you mean, done? All you did was load it onto the boat. Negative. Now what are we doing? How much further now? Bet you never expected we'd end up doing anything like this. Did you surge? Why were we born? Why do we live? That's what we're going to find out with our own eyes. Okay, isn't there like a tech skill for Starkey around here? 
Oh, okay, so we have to go back to the El Nido Triangle and get that. That makes sense. Alright. Well, I guess we can go then. Let's go, yes. So our boat can now fly, apparently. Let's do it. Chrono Cross. I don't know why I randomly said that, but we're flying. A flying ship. Sorry about that, guys. Terra Tower. Okay, well, obviously, yeah, I don't want to be here. I want to switch Starkey out of the party, but I do want to go back to here and get his uh, level 7 technique. You don't have to do this if you don't want to, but I'm going to do it real quick. Alright, let's go ahead and enter here and let's see if we can get it. Not sure what we gotta do exactly. I guess we gotta go in here. I'm done talking his language. <laughs> Starstruck. Level 7. Darkie's level 7 technique. That's something I would like to do is collect all the level 7 techniques for each of the characters that we have. We obviously don't have every single character because you can't have every character in one playthrough. Alright, so I came back here to Viper Manor and instead of taking the... Uh, left, path, left path to go to the library, I took the right path. And we got these statues, I guess we're supposed to move them onto the... Onto these platforms, I guess. And then maybe something will happen. I don't know. Aha! Oh, it's a trap. Great. I wonder if a particular character has to open that chest to get like its tech skill or something. Anyway, I'm looking for Norris because I have Norris in the party, right? I don't know if he's here on this or the other timeline. I'm not sure. That's what I'm trying to figure out. I don't even know where he'd be in here. Not sure. It might be in the other timeline too. I'm not sure. But I was trying to get his level 7 tech skill. By the way, for Guile, you don't need to get his level 7 because he automatically gets it as he levels up. So. You should already have Giles since you get his at level 35. Okay, well here's one tech skill we can get, but 
We gotta bring, I think, uh, the one of the dragoons. But I don't know where Norse is even at. Like I said, it might just be their timeline. But I'm not sure. So that's why I wanted to explore both. Oh, here he is. Right here. Who are you? Another me? What is going on? Let's just say I and another you and leave it at that. Pardon me for saying this, but it appears that both of us need to look at the bigger, big picture. We only have a limited understanding by staying in the same place. So silence. I'm sorry. There's nothing I can do about it. You are a Norse from another world. Please take this, Norris. I no longer need it. And we get the level 7 tech skill for Norris. Top shot. So we return to the mainland in due course. Must be off. Okay. So we got that tech skill. Good. I'll probably get like one or two more in this episode. And then I'll get the rest in the next episode. Alright. Oh, I went to the wrong world. We gotta switch worlds here, but I, I needed to have Viper in the party, and we need to go to the bar. But I gotta switch on over to the home world. There we go. And now we go back to Termina, go to the bar, and we'll be able to get his level 7 tech skill. Open that side up, so come on in. As I close my eyes, a vision of the golden emblem with standing even the most biting of winds comes back to life. Oh, glorious days, come back to me once again. Flag bearer. Viper has received Dragoon's glory as well. Forget what that does. That boosts like a bunch of stats, right? No? It's actually a new item that we haven't got before. Boost magic power, hit percentage. Okay, anyway, I'm going to go into the video here, guys. In the next episode, we'll get the rest of the level 7 techniques. And then the episode after that, we'll head to the Terra Tower. And thank you guys for watching. Later.